plugged in yet because an electrician is going to go ahead and come and insert an outlet right behind the TV. So we have true seamless hidden wires. But this kind of makes me feel like I have company now, you know what I'm saying? I feel less lonely now that this is here. This is a 65 inch TV. Shout out to my brother and my father. So our couch comes next Thursday, I believe. So it'll go, it's a sectional. Y'all see it when it comes. So I got the swivel mount, which allows it to, you know, switch the angle of the TV because I feel like if we're sitting on the couch, we just need to angle the TV, you know, a little bit this way. So I'm still just going to leave it as is. I'm not pressed to watch TV right this minute. So I didn't really go in and set anything up yet. I'm just going to wait till the electrician comes, inserts an outlet right behind the TV. My brother did a great job. So he was the one really doing the installation work. He did an absolute amazing job everything is leveled and even and it's like perfectly centered so yeah it looks great like i feel like i finally have something you know some sort of furniture i'm currently burning this way you know way the hair brand they actually make sense now so they make perfume and candles so i'm burning this melrose place candle by way but it's not burning evenly y'all see it's already tunneling and it's like a brand new candle i don't know why it's doing that and then I'm currently heating up this broccoli cheddar mac and cheese from Panera Bread. So good. And then I'm going to go ahead. Yes, I look the same. I do. And then I'm just going to go ahead and start editing the move out vlogs. I mean, the move out vlogs, girl. And get them up. Get the first one up tomorrow, hopefully. And then tomorrow is Monday. We've already, already been here a week. And I think I want to go ahead and head to Crate and Barrel, Williams, Sonoma, and Sur La Table. They have all three of those in Walnut Creek. I'm going to go ahead and head over there with my friend. Because I was like, I asked on Twitter, I was like, does a store just for cookware exist? And then the girl is pointing me towards the bougie places. So let me just go ahead and check out the bougie, bougie places. Because I do want a real good quality knife set. Like, I don't just want any type of knife. I want them to be good quality. I want them to literally slice through a piece of paper, okay? That good of quality. Slice through a tomato. Like, easy. So, I think I'm going to search for a knife set. Ugh. I look like I look like I'm going through it. So, yeah, let me eat this. Let's edit the first move out vlog to go up tomorrow, which is Monday, hopefully around noon. I just submitted my first campaign for Google. Did I tell you guys? I'm working with Google for six months. For six months, I can't even say months, for their Google Web Stories. So we're, there's basically like a group of creators pioneering Google Web Stories, which basically is like if you Google something, just say you Google, see, I'm in beauty. Let's just say you Google Fancy Beauty Soft Matte foundation right and i created a google web story on the fenty beauty soft matte foundation i'm thinking so they haven't gave us the full details of how it's going to work work because we're still like pioneering it i'm thinking if just say you googled fenty beauty soft matte foundation if i did a google web story on the fenty beauty soft matte foundation my story would pop up at the top of the google search before like you click on the articles and the links and the websites i'm thinking that's how it's gonna work but there's still like um they're still brainstorming how the Google team is still brainstorming how that's gonna work and then basically I'm just creating content for it so I posted my first one I'll go ahead and link it down below I basically um, just introduced myself to the world wide web <laughs> that's what I did and then I have a lot more work to do honey so I did that that's what I was doing all last night let me go ahead and eat this start the vlog get into a, a routine of flow i have no routine right now i have no structure the only thing keeping me sane right now is my air mattress i'm telling y'all that's the only thing keeping me sane i just feel like no one under like no one in my family understands the pressure that i'm under to or the the feeling of overwhelming that i'm under like i don't really know how to describe it plus i don't really let them into my inner emotions because with them it's just never a safe space to express anything so I'm under a lot of stress, a lot of feeling of overwhelming, some feelings of lonely lit loneliness. But because I'm like an introverted person, people don't, don't take my feelings 
of loneliness seriously they think oh she's introverted she keeps to herself it's not a big deal but that's why I just I don't really allow them into my emotions because hey if I'm gonna be invalidated I'm not gonna share myself with you and that's on period because I like safe spaces I want to create a safe space I never really had that like a safe space to um what do you call it to express emotion and it doesn't even have to be a negative emotion it could be an emotion of happiness excitement even sadness and other like sad depressive emotions but there was never a safe space for me to express anything when i told y'all like when i was a kid i couldn't express any emotion i had to straighten up fix my face like i couldn't express anything so i want to create that safe space to express whatever and I feel it's like even just say I'm, I'm alone here no one's here even when I feel myself getting emotional I won't allow me to feel it I like Aaliyah shut up like whatever get over it you know I tell myself that I like I don't allow myself to be emotional I'm like girl you better not cry you better hold that tear back you know I don't even allow myself I don't even allow myself but that's basically just a learned behavior that I had to learn when I was a kid because I had to straighten up and fix my face whenever I felt any bit of emotion. So I have to unlearn that, but that's how I've been operating like years, decades. That's how I've been operating for decades, y'all. I say decades like I'm hella old, but I'd say like I'm 26, so two decades, girl. That's how I've been operating. So then let me go ahead and eat it. Let's sit down and focus on getting this content out on YouTube and actually being a YouTuber, okay? officially been in my new place for a week today is monday november 8th just this time last monday i was scrambling to move in and do all that moving stuff girl Ooh, i was under a lot of stress i was very overwhelmed i was looking a mess too but today is monday um it is currently 11 25 a.m so i did i washed my bedding you know my air mattress bedding grew temporary bedding it's all washed and dried now i just Semi made the bed, you know it's not perfect. Um, today I'm gonna hang out with my friend Jose again. We're gonna go to Crate and Barrel, Williams Sonoma, and Sir La Table in Walnut Creek. I had asked my good good sisters on Twitter if any cookware stores existed, and those are the stores that they gave me. Mine is Crate and Barrel. I already knew I wanted to go in Crate and Barrel, but I like never knew of cookware stores. Like I know cookware brands, you know? Like I know you can go to Macy's and go shop cookware, but I just wanted to know know if there were any stores dedicated to just cookware so we're gonna check out those two stores they're a little bougie so i'm just gonna look for things that are worth buying like probably a nice set a good knife set i'm happy about that i was being very productive this morning i already filmed a campaign oh the product it's already out so let me let me go and share it with you it's so good like it's so good it's this l'oreal true match nude hyaluronic tinted serum I got the shade 67, tan 67. Um, it matched me perfectly. I also got the shade uh, 78, just in case 67 didn't match me, but this is pretty deep. So, and it goes pretty deep. Like the deep shades in this collection run pretty deep and they also mix very well and they match your skin very perfectly and i just really love how you know my light natural makeup came out today so i filmed that campaign i absolutely love the product i feel like that's a great dupe to the ysl new bear look tint that i created a campaign for this is the ysl 
new bear look tint i've tried it i've used it i really love how it looks on the skin as well this one is more bougie in price and i believe the l'oreal true match is half the cost and it looks it looks amazing like i really love how both of these look so if you're feeling bougie try the YSL new bear look tint the shade is larger for the YSL new bear look tint there are plenty of shades and then this shade range isn't too extensive for l'oreal um, but it does run pretty deep, so I guess you can make mix and match if you wanted to. I actually didn't have to. I usually do. I'm a person who always has to mix shades, but I didn't have to for this one. So this is a great affordable dupe to the YSL. And in the YSL New Bear Look Tint, I am the shade 15. So there's that. We already filmed that campaign. I just had to do a TikTok for that. Jose should be coming around noon. Jose also has a YouTube channel. Very aesthetic, very high quality. Like, she gives the girls aesthetic quality. She's a very awesome and amazing creator. So, I will link her channel down below. Be sure to check it out. She's also on Instagram. She makes great content. Um, like, she inspires me every day. I'm like, girl, I need to, I need to learn how to get those B-roll shots that you be getting. Like, I don't know how to do the B-roll. So, she's really inspiring me to get in my B-roll bag. So yeah, she should be coming shortly. My couch comes this week. I believe my couch comes either Wednesday or Thursday. Okay, so it's Thursday. My couch is coming Thursday. So I'll officially have a TV and a couch. Now I just need to really secure bed stuff. So I keep seeing Brooklinen sponsorships, okay? But my good, good girl. So let me just go ahead and use their codes. I gotta pick one because I see too many of my faves getting sponsored by Brooklinen. So I need to pick someone's code to use and just go ahead and buy my sheet set. And then I still need like a comforter, pillows, and a duvet thingy. I don't know, I've never used a duvet before. A duvet is very new to me. It sounds very fancy, so we're gonna, the Brook Linen bed set comes with a duvet cover, so I guess I have to find me a duvet girl, girl. I don't even know where the, where the hell did they sell duvets at? What the hell is a duvet? This is my friend Jose. You guys have seen her before at my house. Remember? Yes. She brought me the, she brought me the duvet Cloupon? Yeah, something like that. I don't know. But hey, y'all. What are you I'm doing? Jose Nicole. You're on YouTube, right? Yes, I'm on YouTube. Jose Nicole? Jose Nicole, yes. It's In Jose Nicole. Instagram? Jose Nicole. TikTok? Jose Nicole. That's on period. <laughs> Cheers to Cheesecake Factory drinks. Oop, almost dropped it. Hold oh, on. Lord. Rip it. Cheers. I got the sangria. She got the raspberry lemon drop. We're at the Cheesecake Factory. The only thing I like here is the mac and cheese balls. That's it. And the bread. That's it. Go and ask the tea. Yes. Thank you. Mmm. Got the mac and cheese balls. So good. Yes. Yes, HD. <laughs> so we looked at Crane Barrel, Sir La Table, and William Sonoma. And while those all had great kitchenware products, I realized I am not a seasoned chef. I'm not a seasoned cook. I don't cook much. So I don't know why I'm going into those stores trying to buy those bougie items. I need to focus on building my bed. My couch is coming on Thursday. We have a TV. I need to build my bed and make it a very luxurious hotel-like comfortable cozy escape plush excuse me 
This place here is a Main Street kitchen and bar. Yeah, let's go. Where um, is it? The drinks look like it's good, but um, I'm trying to see where it's at. Hold on. I keep forgetting I need to do my angle this way because of my fat ass chin. <laughs> <laughs> she scared the shit out of me. Why did she come up behind me? Oh We're gonna celebrate Jose hitting 5,000 on YouTube. Yay! Ah! Y'all so happy. She works so hard. Her content's so good. Like I, I was, I was, I was telling them about you before. Oh, that's sweet. We're gonna celebrate her hitting 5K. You know, some drinks on me. Okay. It's a three-minute walk. Are you okay? I, I feel fine. Okay, let's go then. Yeah. I'm just trying to figure out which way to go because I'm like, the Main, Google what's thing don't Main Street? That's sense. Broadway. Should we go down there? Where are we at? So this is. Wait. So that's Broadway. Broadway. Oh, we need to go this way. Okay. Yeah, this way. So I'm gonna go ahead and buy those Brook Linen sheets. Have you heard of Brook Linen? Yes. Yes, I'm gonna go ahead and buy those. Everyone says they're so good. Everyone's getting sponsored by I them too. I haven't gotten, I haven't gotten them, but everyone says that those sheets are hecka good. I'm gonna go ahead and buy them. Yeah. Total is about to be two hundred sixty dollars. Yeah, they say it's like um, that's like their their price range, but it's cheaper than the real deal. But, but without it's quality. With, Yes. Without breaking the bank for it. Because without the discounts, because I got I get a discount for being a first time buyer. Without the discount, it'll be four hundred dollars. Oh, so you get a discount for the two hundred. Girl, I'll be trying to look for people with little promo codes all the time. But I would. And I, I support the girls. Yes. See, the, the Brooklyn is only sheets. I need a comforter. Oh yeah, you need everything. Basically. I need a duvet because it comes with a duvet cover. But so I don't you have need a duvet. duvet. Yes. I have a duvet and a, a cover. I got the cover from. Um, Marshalls and I got the duvet on from H&M home. Where did you oh H&M H&M has home? Yeah, and Zara On online? Yeah online. Not in person? Not in person. The only place the only time that they have oh, it man. in person Yeah, turn right. The in-person one is like out of like country. Okay. Like I think um, Like Canada, Australia, something like that. Um, is it raining? It, it's is it, it's is giving. It, is, it, is it giving rain? It, it's it's I'm drizzling like, oh, a little are bit. Are we not doing this? <laughs> oh, pottery yes, barn. Sis, I'm definitely not dressed for no rain. Me neither. So I, I hope here. it's just a slight drizzle. Yeah, because I'm my I'm, battery but already. But you, at least you got your um, my wig, that and your jacket. But I'm right right now. I'm pretty good. Okay, as long I as mean, you're good. I just want to make sure you're good. <clears throat> we like to come home. Yeah, like it is. This. <laughs> it is hitting my face. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Well, Okay. What else do you need for a bed? Pillows. pillows. Where do you get pillows from? I know I understand Target, but I want quality. So I got I got these pillows from a hotel that I had went to. Oh, you did say that. Yeah. Um, what, what's the brand? I can't remember. You can't. Okay. Okay. But I know I do have the link in my YouTube, so I can find the, the link and see what the brand's name is. Yep. Let me so go. that one was good. That's and giving then, that's giving hotel luxury vibes. Yes. Okay. But I have felt better though. It's just like you have to figure out like if you go to a hotel that you like and you like their pillows, you just ask them for the um you can just ask them what brand the pillows I should have did that when I stayed in LA at the Beverly Hills Marriott. Just call them. Boy, them pillows. You can you can literally just call clutch. them and they'll tell you. Okay. Yeah. That's what I did. I called and was like, Hey, I'm trying to buy the pillows from the you know, that you guys use and they just sent me they emailed me the link basically. Okay. Yeah. So all right, so it should be up here. Is it that one with the blue it lights? It looks like it. Yeah. It looks like it, yeah. Okay, I need them. Oh, I need a mattress. Duh. Oh, no. <laughs> I need a yeah, mattress. Yeah, you need to work on the bed first. That's the main thing, because that's where you're going to get your sleep. But I'm worried about your goddamn cups. cups. I know. When you got temporary ones right now. <laughs> Girl. That's what? the Lee Michelle for you. Right. She doesn't know how to prioritize. It's, blue. it's the blue ones. Have you been here? No. Why do they nothing set Wait, up? Else? There's nothing outside. Oh, are they? Are they? But I don't think they're open. Ooh, fancy. Oh no, I'm not ready yet. I'm sorry. Wait, one second. Come on, Jose, get it together. <laughs> get it together. Okay. Ooh, fancy. Okay, I'll call you back when I get home. <laughs> 